Department said, I, I don't know how to play football any differently. $75,000 fines, of course, for his hits. And what does he do? Wow. I'm going to get to Chad Henney one way or the other. 6-3 Miami, second quarter. Big Ben Roethlisberger, first road game. Heinz Ward, and for the 184th straight game, which began his rookie year in 98, Tom, Heinz Ward has caught a patch fourth alone on the all-time list. One of the great receivers in the history of the game. A great job of, of shaking off sap and then working his way as he's done so often into the end zone. He caught seven for 131 Roethlisberger and... The 60-minute man, Mike Wallace, makes the catch. Clock ticking, 53 yard. He's good on those bombs. 17-9 Pittsburgh. Two minutes left in the half. Chad Henney to Devon Best. And look at Best. What? And he makes the best move right there, getting into the end zone. It's a 17-16 game. Close, good game. 20-19 Pittsburgh, fourth quarter. Miami, Chad Henney. Brian Hartline. 24 yards, two plays later from the midfield stripe. Tenney again. To Anthony Fasano. Big tight end, bang, get out of my way. To the Steeler, 28, gain of 22. Won the game last week in overtime at Lambeau, five for five. Dan Carpenter field goals, Miami leads 22-20. Next possession, Pittsburgh, third and five. Roethlisberger back to pass. Waltzing Mawildi. Waltzing Mawildi. Mawildi Moore takes it down to the 14. 29-yard gain. Third and goal from the two. Ben calls his own number. He's at the one and boom! It's originally called touchdown. Even though it's a scramble for the ball, Miami thinks they're on it. First things first. Touchdown. But take another look, which they would have to be challenged, and rightly so, by Tony Sperano. Yeah, and Chris Clemens right there, not a great view of it. You can see him make contact. You see the ball come out on the other side. Now we get the end zone shot. You can see clearly Clemens knocks the ball out before it crosses the plane of the end zone, and boy, havoc breaks loose after that. Well, and first, Big Ben tells his coach, Mike Tomlin, I was in before the fumble, but no. And then it's hard to tell from this shot who fell on the ball, though it looked like a lot of Dolphins, Tom. Referee Gene Steratore then came out with the ruling under the hood. First things first, it was a fumble. But since neither team to the refs could clearly, we couldn't tell clearly who recovered it, and we called it a touchdown, we really didn't look. Miami gave up a field goal to Jeffrey, 23-22 on fourth down, and then Jason Worlds hits Henny. And the Steelers hold on to win 23-22 to the chagrin of Tony Sperano and the Dolphins. They played the Steelers tough, but because it was ruled they didn't get the ball, an 18-yard field goal by Reed wins it by a point.